Yo, Coach Jim. Yo. I'm here. As I am not, as this is my first mystery tournament, and I don't want to fall behind. It's okay. No worries, man. This is gonna be casual as fuck. <laughs> Considering all mystery tournaments are gonna be mashy as fuck. Depends on the game, really. <laughs> uh, also, welcome, opponent. Thanks for joining. The microphone's working right. Yeah, it's working. No worries, man. Yes. Yeah, I'm just posting this stuff in a couple of places. Should be, should be beginning soon. Um. Make sure you have the ROM set on a standby. I have the I have the other thing in case even in case I don't have a ROM I can just even wait. Even if you have the JSON link, it's it's all fine. It's, it's not a problem. Just make sure you have the thing on standby. That's basically all I'm gonna say. I'm just po posting the live stream in a couple of places. That's basically all I'm doing. All right, so. Not this logo, this logo, yeah, definitely. So, the wheel is set, everything is ready to go, and I'm gonna live stream the wheel, just so, just so, you, guys, just so you guys know what you're in for. Okay, wheel is on stream. And then Third Strike shows up, uh, and then Third Strike shows up. <laughs> okay. okay, so I'm guessing you're, uh, you guys are seeing the wheel? So this is the wheel. No, I, I'm just saying it as a joke. Just like it rolls and it gets, uh, yeah. it hits third strike. Yeah, the first game. I forgot to hold on. Forgot to shuffle the bracket. Hold on. Yeah, we ha we are nine. Why people. would you need to shuffle? What would you need to shuffle the bracket for? It's, it's a bunch of people that might not know how to play the game that comes up. Yeah, because I want it to be as random as fucking possible. <laughs> okay, fair enough. <laughs> All right. How do we make a mystery tournament more mystery? Roll again. <laughs> nah, <laughs> Roll nah. the bracket again. Nah, here's the thing. <laughs> if a game is considered unplayable, meaning desync, there will be a, a respin. If there is like a reset, there will be a respin. Just so you know. <laughs> All right. So, uh, oh, good luck. May the game you want or you're good at or you like. Uh, be picked. May a but, game show up yeah. that is actually functional. That's all I care about. A well, functional game. Most of the games are tested. Most. Not everything, unfortunately. I can play non-functional game. I do it all the time. Alright! <laughs> Vampire Savior. Dude, I... I... <laughs> I... <laughs> Vampire Savior uh, between Conspiratorial and Scuddy. Just those two? Everyone else just waits? Yeah, it's gonna be every match, spin. Every match, spin. Uh, <laughs> Do you understand that? I, yeah, I understand that. Just like, I said this, I said it as a joke, it was gonna be Third Strike. It wasn't Third Strike, it was VSAP, like, the point remains the same. I was just rolling, and then it's just a like very like yeah. popular game. I mean, or decently thing, popular it's, at least. It's it, it's a mix between popular game, Kusoge, obscure puzzle games, sports games, you name it. Everything that's basically on Fight Gate Two. <laughs> I'm just. <laughs> yeah, it's basically that's yeah, that's how this entire thing works. All right, I have the game. Um, luckily, I have the game. All right. All right. And Conspiratorial is here. Let's see if Scuddy is here. Uh, Scuddy ain't here yet. He's probably getting the game. It's all good. <laughs> it's part. It's part of the adventure. <laughs> but I think that the list that I'm currently having is like 150. I lowered it from 160 to 150 something or some shit like that because apparently i rem 
Uh, it's not apparently. I removed the games that failed on regular tournaments and that have like big decent issues like Blood Warrior. Like, oh, I don't know. Like other games. Yeah, you probably uh, dealt with bigger lists, huh, opponent? No, this is my first round. Uh, mystery no, I was, uh, I was asking opponent because opponent is has had, um, I think, uh, experiences with mystery tournament, right? Mm. Okay. Uh, Scuddy says he's coming. Okay. Okay, they're in. Okay. All right, so hello folks and welcome to the monthly mystery tournament. I think it's number eight. Um, but yeah, I have to take a, have to take, a, uh, take a look at the numbers. But yeah, what, what this is basically is that mystery tournament is each, each match is a different game. So I like spin it on the wheel of names from uh, from a suggested game game list from the Thunderia Discord. So yeah, whatever game stops, that's the game they play. Unless they have like desyncing issues or can't get the game or something like that, then we respin. Other than that. Every match is gonna be live streamed. Nine people, so yeah. So yeah, good luck. Oh, this is gonna be played only on 5K2, so. Yeah. And, do, uh, and anything attached to it. The number of the I game, guess. The, the number of the games that's on the wheel is 150. I think. I'm not sure. I might have lost count. All right. Anyways, match one goes to Conspiratorial. Oh yeah, first match is uh, VSAF. We cost control and scuddy. <laughs> we had. Um, I said it was gonna. I predicted third strike, and I was close enough. <laughs> Here's the thing. I'm not sure we had third strike being picked here. Second impact, sure. New generation, sure. But third strike, I'm not that sure about. But then again, this might be the day when that changes. You know. <laughs> we might get this. Maybe. Hell. We might get Test Strike, we might get a Wind Jammers, hell, we might get Pack Attack, we don't know. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait to show up on the Wind Jammers, to get Wind Jammers, fire on myself, show up in the lobby and immediately get challenged by Trouble Deer. Uh, I mean, Survival Trouble Deer is still gonna be... Trouble Deer is grand, those two. Even if you get Survival Wars, even if we did like Survival Wars tournament before this, if we get that team, it's gonna be great. I am hoping for Street Fighter the movie or Street Fighter 1. Street Fighter 1, I'm not ready. Alright, GG's, Casper Total takes it. But the set's already over. The, the set's already over. Time for, for main roll number two. All right, let me just make sure this is done. All right. Actually, I just realized uh, losers round one is just like this two is, people. What's it? This is gonna be Ikigai versus Mahmoud Ehab. So this is the so the next spin is gonna be for those for those two. All right. So spinning on the way three. Two, one, go. We can't see the wheel. Okay, there we go. Yeah, it, there's a bit of one, uh, when you stream more uh, voice chat, there is. <laughs> Why? It's, I mean, it's not. Wait, this one's blue? No, this is. Ikigai and Ma mode. Yes, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I am sorry to say that that's, that's the case. Those two are about to suffer. 
Um, Pack Attack is a, is a normal game. I'll just tell him to do... Two rounds are going to be equal to two matches. So, no worries. Um, Ikigai versus Mahmoud. Pack Attack. Pack Attack. FT2. Two rounds. Two rounds or two matches. Just making sure they know. <laughs> the thing is, this is in this game, one of the. I think it was Mystery Tournament number two. Michin and uh, Justin Wong were in Grand Finals. And this is how Justin Wong won one of the Grand Finals. Okay, so let me just go into Pack Attack. Pack slash attack, or a simple one. Don't, okay. Yes. I should be looking for the... Yo, Retro Action Squad, welcome to the welcome to the Mystery Tournament stream. This should be fun. It's a Mega Drive game. Mahmoud versus Ziki guy. This should be interesting. <laughs> Hopefully, um, Ziki guy. That's that, that's fun. Uh, let's choose Jux. How do you say your name? I've always called you Flynn because I can't pronounce the second name or the second half of your username. I can't I can't I'm say Jux. it. So you just called you Flynn. Flynn Jux. I just never changed my Twitter. I just say it as Joe. Oh. Okay. Fair enough. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let's hope that Icky guys in here. Dude, you executed that joke better than I did. Holy shit. Uh, okay. Aaron Powery FGC, we can't pronounce each other's so usernames. I think that's more of a pronunciation <laughs> issue than it is a fucking pronunciation. Pronunciation, it, it falls to the wayside. It's all the game. Uh, also, who did they start? I don't know. Uh, Mouth is uh, still downloading, I think. Or me thinks. Could be. Uh, I think Mahmoud has the JSON link, I'm not sure. So, auto download it. So, there's that. Hold on. Up. Oh. I'm. File Exploder. Yeah. There was a YouTube video showcasing Thunder with this <laughs> on the Justin Wong <laughs> channel. <laughs> Him doing the grand finals and this. <laughs> like, it's really freaking. It's really funny.
you tell me this is it because I'm growing it and I don't know if this is it. Uh, yeah, it should be. Back attack. Yeah, I think. I mean, here's the thing. The ROM says pack attack. So that's basically it. Mm. Yeah, but I imagine it requires both. Yeah. You guys are not in the lobby. That's what I'm waiting for. Uh, sorry about the delay, guys. I'm getting the exact wrong. Takes I think just about everyone is waiting on Iki guy since he no, not... Mahmoud, yeah. he, he's the one who doesn't have the lo the ROM. He he's the one who doesn't have the ROM. It's okay. I'll wait. I'll wait a, a couple of more minutes. It's not that big of an issue. If not, I'll just delay the match. If he has like ROM issues, I can just skip to the next match. Delete a match. So that means all for someone else. So that, so that mean, I mean, the game is still gonna be the same. It's still gonna be pack attack. It just. Okay. All right. I guess your match is up, Kusha. So this is gonna be why me? Because Majin is not here. Actually, no. Actually, it's not here. Oh my bad. It's not here. It's Jukes. Which is the opponent? So this is gonna um, this is gonna be Jew. what in the actual Joe Joe Jukes. Iki guys yes. in. Iki guys in. Hold on. If Iki guys in, we don't have to do it. Okay. Uh, Iki guy is there or not? Well, not in the lobby still. So. Okay, pack attack, mega drive. Okay, uh, I just don't want to make people wait. Seems like this uh, match is gonna go. There, there they are. Okay. They're finally playing? Oh, they're, yeah. They're in the lobby. They're in. They're in the room. Okay. They're playing. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully, Majin makes it on time today. You can, go, you can go normal mode, but whatever. They pick versus. Doesn't matter. I'll let it slide. Middle, yeah. You can go with middle if you want. Uh, because there are three rounds, and I don't want to wait that long. Two rounds is going to be uh, two matches. So, basically, from what I've understood from the last time I did the tournament, for Pack Attack specifically, is that you have to make a line like any Tetris game, right? However, you That's have very... however you have creatures that stand in your way. So you use the Pac-Man to eat the creatures. Pac-Man goes in a certain way when you drop it. So yeah, basically that's how it works. 
It's Pac-Man Tetris. Yes, it's Pac-Man Tetris. What gravity it seems. I, I just looked like I'm looking at you guys' side. I see a couple like pieces just dropping straight down. I mean... This is called cascading gravity by people who are into stuff like this. <laughs> I mean, yeah. There was um, there was a pro pack attack player when, when we did the tournament for pack attack. There's clearly a pro for everything. And yeah. That that's unfortunate for Mal. He tried to he, he tried to get Pac-Man to move one way. Pac-Man said no, and he moved another way. Oh, there's the intended result he wanted. Uh, the fairy, I think, removes the color. I'm not sure actually how the fairy works. Can't say with how the fairy works if I don't know how the fairy works. It's not exactly I'm a long ass game. game though. People think it's a long ass game, but it's a long ass game if you play it normally. Good thing we're not playing it normally. It's as though Mahmoud has experience with this. They're probably setting up chains. Yeah, it's it's a puzzle game. I, I'm guessing he does. Oh there was a pat <laughs> I didn't look at it. Alright, he so... takes uh, match one. Zero one. Right. Oh, and by the way, if people say why aren't there any um, SNES games, it's due to the fact that SNES runs like hard garbage and like. Good. <laughs> so I decided to remove the SNES games in its entirety. However, the uh, the NES games have stayed on due to some games being being successful, let's say. Functional. Successful, basically. There was a there is ah. there is I would say a medium-sized um, community for Dream Mechplay, which they they love the heck out of that game. I can see why it's really. You know, now that I think about it, I think I might want to take back that previous uh, comment I made that I said uh, this is basically Pac-Man Tetris. No, this doesn't look at all like Pac-Man Tetris. It's more, it's more Puyo uh, Pac-Man. Due to you still have the clear lines. It's... Yeah. yeah. If anything, but... this is more in common with Baku Baku Animal. I never played this, so I wouldn't. I wouldn't be able to, you know. Uh, that was a drop puzzle game by Sega for STV and involves animals having to collect oh. fruits or vegetables based on their color. Oh. It's similar to this, but without the plain wall pieces. Yeah, I think this is like a hybrid between Puyo Puyo and uh, Tetris. Like Puyo Puyo Tetris, but not really. <laughs> there might be in it. Oh, sadly, just... that is. Game two for yeah, yeah, that's the GGs. Yeah, that is the GGs. That is pain. That is that is pain for Maud. Suffering. He really wish. All uh, right. So so the thing that I'm gonna spin because uh, Mijin hasn't reported himself in yet. Uh, it's gonna be Flint Jukes versus the opponent. All right. So, this is going to be removed from the list. So, every game that uh, that lands on will not be repeated. So, I remove it from the list. So, let's say if someone played Pack Attack now, they won't be, be able to play Pack Attack again. So, that's how it goes. That's fair enough. Yeah. Yeah. So, if people play Third Strike once, they won't be able to play Third Strike. But then again, we have three variations of Street Fighter 3. So, that's not an issue. That's a non-issue, actually. Okay, so let's see what we got now. <laughs> Alright, another Mega Drive game. Street Fighter 2 Plus, Japan, Asia, Korea version. I'm so... This is for... This is for Jukes and... Yeah. I'll make sure they know. Uh, 
about this. Yeah. Well, it wouldn't be a mystery tournament without Kasuge, so. <laughs> You're going to have to explain. Okay, if you're aware of the nonsense this game has, can you please allow me, uh, can you please notify me now so I, so I know what's happening? I have no fucking clue. Yeah. I'll be right back. Actually, I think it's just a vanilla Street Fighter 2 plus something like that. Yo, Tamas. So, in this version, if you choose the regular, like, game start at the beginning, it's CE. But if you pick Excite, then it's Hyper Fighting. That's basically all the Genesis version of Plus is. It's just like Special Championship Edition. Gotcha. All right, so I got to make sure I have the game, but I think I have the game. Because we did a tournament for this? Maybe? Yeah, we did a tournament for this. Yeah, you did. I think Majin won it. Yeah, could be. Yeah, I'm just uh, testing my buttons for Mega Drive real quick. Yeah, no problem, man. It's no problem. <laughs> Someone at uh, Red Traction Squad asks, uh, can we play on like, Site 10? Because I'm down for that shit. I mean, whatever the opponents agree on, I'm not going to say what. <laughs> uh, red, um, I'm guess. I mean, from the gameplay of it, it feels like a Kusoge game, but not really because I think it's like early gameplay for <laughs> Street Fighter Two. <laughs> On Excite Ten, it is most definitely Kusoge. I can <laughs> confirm. As, as an Excite 10 enjoyer can say, game completely busted it. That <laughs> Excite 10. <laughs> yeah. No, I mean the frame, the frame skip in Excite 10. Also, you just like you have to get used to your inputs, kind of um, like Ontario, getting glossed uh, over a lot. I'll Ontario play. We're currently waiting for the opponents to set up uh, Street Fighter 2 Plus Mega. Okay, I issued the challenge. There is Excite 10 from default settings. Yeah. I mean, Excite 10 is, um, it's like on the regular main menu. Yeah. Main you just menu. turn the stars all the way up. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. I'm going into their match right now. I, I didn't even know yep. about the mode. If, if, uh, if Thomas told me initially, oh yeah, put it on Excite 10. I would have put it on Excite 10 for a tournament, but we did like regular shtick. So it felt, it felt like... Uh. <laughs> I really, I, I'm really, really fond of this port though. This is like no, my favorite port of Street Fighter 2 probably. Because you got CE, you got Hyper Fighting, you got Goofy Ass Excite 10. But this was called the Special Champion Edition in English. Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. I remember... I remember when playing this, I, I thought to myself, Oh, what the fuck is this? It's like I'm watching Z2 Battle. I can't do my stuff. I think it's like Z2 Battle not a, right now. Blanca's, Blanca's not a bad strategy. Hyper fighting Blanca's strong. And the jump-ins are really good. And on Excite 10, jump-ins are like more powerful. Wait, why don't modern games have this kind of speed? Oof. This speed would be great. This is even faster than reset, man. Right? <laughs> Which, what are the odds of you first picking reset when you first match? Hideous. <laughs> oh! 
Alright, Flynn Dukes wins uh, match one. It's zero one. Honda hands really strong. On Excite 10 even stronger. It's basically the basically the mantra of Excite 10. Everything is just stronger. Mm. Nothing is like really particularly worse, I guess. I'm just sad the top five at 2005 doesn't work on fucking. Wait, is something wrong? Because it's tough. Oh, okay, doesn't matter. Yeah. We're changing out to a different game after this, right? Yeah. After after your match against opponent versus Flynn and Jukes, after your. You, so you have to do another. Uh, so Flynn Jukes won 0 1, right? So, he, so you guys have to do FT2s. You know, if you're gonna call him Jukes, you should just call me the OP opponent. <laughs> or OP opponent. <laughs> the op. Yeah, that works too. All right, I, I'll, I'll call him. I'll call him Joe then, or Theo. I, I like the idea of calling him Flynn Flynn Jeeks. Yeah. Oh, it's first to two for that game. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It's first yeah, to two. Oh, oh okay. Yeah, it's I'll just a match up again then. It's basically a match up. Awesome. Yeah. So I thought it was just one set for every game. No, 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 no. No, it's just um, every matchup. I, I spend a wheel for that one. Okay, another Excite 10 then. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> mm. Okay. No. Last week, Thomas, it was like Pusoge Day. That's what happened. We had like five Kusoge uh, games on the last one. <laughs> I just forget the names of What got ran? I don't know, you're gonna have to look because uh, I backed it up on YouTube. So. I just remember ah. five Kusoge's were showcased. <laughs> and, and the event before that, it was freaking Fatal Fury Day. <laughs> like, we had, I think, more than five Fatal Fury games on there. I think I was there for. I think I lost to Slam Town for Fatal Fury Day. I think that. I think we got Fatal Fury Two or something like that. I think we also had Fatal Fury One at one point. All right, round one goes for. Oh. What did I miss? Uh, Absolutely nothing. <laughs> well, Thomas was explaining uh, the adva uh, the advantage of playing. Uh, on Excite 10 for Super Street Fighter 2 plus. Excite, Excite 10, the sacred meta. Yeah. Uh, I, Joe the, the funniest, the funniest thing to me though is if you go on Fightcade at like 3 a.m. my time <laughs> and you look at the, the Street Fighter 2 plus lobby, there will always be like random Indians playing at like Excite 10. So there, I, I theorize that there's an Indian, like, Excite 10 community out there. Gives me hope for life. Uh, Are you sure it's not just they made it a standard for themselves? Alright, uh... Yeah, that's, that's what I kind of think they do. So, um, Coast Jam Conspiratorial. You guys ready? Sure, what are, what are we gonna roll, dude? Let's go. I'm watching, I'm watching the stream right now. Um, we'll see, actually. <laughs> Uh, because I'm gonna... Come on, Street Fighter the movie. Let's go. Come on, Survival Arts. Go, come on, dude. Give me something I know how to play. The thing that I don't want is games that make me mash, because I'll just, like, auto-lose those, because hand injuries. <laughs> Marvel Super Heroes? Alright. That's definitely a game. That's a game. <laughs> Haven't played this in a... I haven't played this in like a thousand years, so I have like, it's a it's an even matchup or whatever. All right. So I I, yeah, I can only imagine good. Coast Jam has not played this game like at all, or maybe or maybe once or twice you have, you know. Mm. I have. I at least go on say I have. I mean, right, if, if it was tomorrow's Capcom One, I would have been much happier. All right, let's go, Joe Scam. Alright, I'm getting uh, the I'm getting the ROM. Hold on. Because apparently God damn it. 
Apparently he doesn't have it. Wait, I can I can probably upload it too. I, I no, might no, be no, faster, I, I might no, be no, slower. No, 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 don't worry about it. I have I have Toby's link for the um, ROM sets. No worries. Hello. Who dares enter as the fifth member of the commentary? Emma states, hello. Uh, hello. Let's, let's see. Uh, shit. Oh, hi, MM. You just Hello. caught us uh, doing mystery tournaments, so. Are we starting now, or you know? We've well, already started. Yeah, we've already started. Okay, sick. Sorry, I just got. Sorry, I was tired yesterday, and I forgot to finish making my tournament, so I had to do it today, and I almost forgot. <laughs> F. Man, that was yesterday. It was a very exhausting day. Okay, I got it. All right, so I'm downloading this. Don't worry about it. So what's the, so let's see. What's the mystery today for these for our competitors? Well, right now, uh, Coach Sam and Thomas are gonna play Marvel superheroes FT2. Yeah, oh, you, you let you let us know when we can start. Right. No, it's, I'm... it's no problem. Uh, can uh... can we start now? No, no, Are we good? Not yet. Hold on. Okay, okay. All right, I got you. No, no, so I think my... Meeting. I think my buttons are set. Let's... Okay, sick. Nine players. Oh, we already got done with nine. So we're at... Looks like we're getting ready to go to top two, okay. four, six. Just put it here. So we're on top eight right now. All right. 5k2. Let's see if this works. Yes, it works. You can start. All right, so who we have today? So who is our opponents today? Uh, or right now? Who are the commentators? Coach Jam versus Conspiratorial, or Thomas in the voice okay. chat. <laughs> All right, nice to meet you guys. Hope you guys have fun. Yeah. Good luck. Hopefully. Okay. Spectating. Okay, I can't see anything, so I'm probably no. That's okay. Don't too. worry about it. It's uh, it's you know, slow getting in into the match. Here it is. Match is up. All right, so we got the Incredible Hulk versus Wolverine. It's gonna be a fun match. Uh, don't make the Hulk angry. You don't like him when he's angry. He's pretty strong, but I mean, Wolverine's my boy, you know. So <laughs> I'm gonna have to go for Wolverine. So close game, we gotta win this. Nice knockdown into pursuit. Hit him with those lows. Infinity Good and beyond. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow. Those rocks. Oh wow, I didn't know they jumped that high. This is basically what Marvel vs. Yeah, Capcom is, is Well, to this is like. not really Marvel vs. Capcom. This is before Marvel vs. Capcom was a thing. I think this yeah, was like the saying, like, test run game for it. So, considering yeah. MVC is, is like fast, right? So, this this is fast, oh, yeah. but not as fast as MVC. So. Just the best Oh, story. that's interesting. I didn't know they used the Infinity Stones in this one. Yeah, they did. Huh. Oh, that's interesting. I think that's the first time they appear. Alright, round one goes to Coast Gem. Alright, but it's still not over to the fat lady thing. Yeah. Oak is pretty strong. What the? Hey. <laughs> Ow. Gamma Crush. Well, it's like he stole some. Round two Ooh. goes for Conspiratorial. Man, he even with that rock. Yeah. That had to hurt. Good thing he's immortal. Good thing a uh, Wolverine is staying near immortal. Shoot. Mm, not immortal, but in Hill and Factor. He's probably killing. Well, I mean, he's not. Yeah, he ain't killing Wolverine that easily. Yeah. Oh, what? He recovered? Oh no. The reality thing. I am inevitable. I am inevitable. 
speed. Alright, see if we can come back from it. Hulk throwing things, Hulk smash. Conspiratorial gets his first round. Hulk smash, I think. Conspiratorial takes the next one. Man. Quick, use Iron Man. I mean, I am Iron Man. Every character oh, is good here, Spider so it doesn't really matter who anyone picks. We got Spider Man. I'm sorry, Spider Man's the best character in the game. <laughs> oh, we wish he was, but yeah. Look, I don't. Look, Peter Parker is a cool character. I can always admit that. He just Spider Man in general. Like he doesn't have. He's not even that strong, but he still. You know, he doesn't need to be that strong. Okay, he got the Power Stone. Let's go. A nice uh, stone building. Hulk is just smashing. I can't really tell you what he's doing. He's just smashing. <laughs> nice air. Nice jump. Going back. I feel like here, you can't give Hulk space. So you have to give him. You have to be up in front of him. It seems like. Hey, he flies so freaking high. Oh. Wrong way, Goose. Okay. Coast Jam. Coast Jam trying to take it back. He has the Power Stone and the Time Stone. And the boy Conspiratorial has the Space Stone. Oh, that's okay. wrong. Conspiratorial. I don't think he's got the full stone. Wait, do you lose stones if you get hit hard enough? Gamma Crush. Oh, the full stone recovers life. Okay, that's interesting. Good now. Yeah. Ooh, nice trick, no sleep. Ah, too far. Round two boost for Conspiratorial. Set point for Conspiratorial. Yeah. We got four of the stones. We got five stones now. If you get six stones, you can Thanos snap. If there any counter. Berserker Barrage. Oh, he's like he's still one of the stone. Super armor. Gamma. Oh, but it's not over yet. Oh, can he come back? Is he going to be? Is he going to? It's possible. So uh, close. All right. He's so close. Uh, I, got, I got surprisingly uh, competitive. Yeah. I mean, that was a good match. Is it good? I mean, yeah. Let's see. Um, I'm going to make sure the is reported. So that's going to be 2 0 for Conspiratorial. That was good. That's did, too. So did Majin respond? Well, probably not. Because I'm going to ping for Mystery Tournament. I only ping people once. So, yeah, no. He hasn't responded. Mm -hmm. So that's. So he's out? Well, he's out from the winners. He might respond later, so. Uh, yeah. For the time being, I advance. Yeah, I advance by auto. Yeah. Our previous. All right, so turbo. this is going to be spun for Terrell versus Joe. Okay? All right. All let's, right. Let's go Terrell and Joe. Let's see if I'm going to be lucky again. Probably not. Chow, you're you're always lucky. Better than my luck. All right. Looks like we have. Well, Bobble. 
four. Why are those oh. three aligned? Why are those three together? It's like, what? <laughs> oh, looks like Trout may be in mud. Mm. Let's see. Any any puzzle game is a free round on me. I suck at every puzzle game. <laughs> oh, shoot. I mean, you, uh, keep positive. You'll be fine. I have faith. Oh. Puzzle Bubble 4. The game I have a little bit of experience in, but not enough. <laughs> so basically what you're saying is you may have a G-Stats chance. Uh, maybe, maybe not. It really depends. I mean, everyone might have a fucking chance in this one. We had a Puzzle Bubble tournament like last week. So. Actually, not last week. Maybe yesterday. Possibly. Just gotta see if I have this. Nah, probably not. I'll pro I'll I'll get it. it. Won't take me that long. Maybe. So it's P Bubble Four J. Okay. It's a good thing I have this open. I love mystery tournaments. Too bad they are dime a dozen. Uh, unless you're a guardian, you host like a few every so often. I don't know the exact time. Well, no, here's the thing. I haven't seen a whole lot of people hosting them. It's it's like only me and like Chippy Roulette. And Chippy Roulette has like region lock. That's the European thing. So. Uh, Guardian hosts one, one once a month, yeah. but that's also region locked to NA. Yeah, pretty much. So yeah, most most mis I tried to join, uh, or I was gonna join that. Um, I can't even remember. There, there was like a mystery tournament, but then it was EU locked. Yeah. But it's understandable. You have more connection issues when shit's global. Just gonna set my control. Wait. What? All right, I'm probably gonna head out for a little bit, sure. but thank. I right. it's good hanging out with you guys for a Wait, little bit. Wait, there's, there's a this. problem starting this game. What the hell? All right, I'm probably gonna have to use a uh, uh, JSON link. So. It opened fine for me. Really? But uh, ignore me. Ignore ignore my case. I just. Okay, I'll try it. I'll try one more run. Let's see if this is gonna work. Because it has like, oh, it has parent ROMs. Wait, that's why. Mm -mm. This, in order for some games to work, they need like parent ROMs or some shit like that. It's it's a good thing this downloads really quick. Alright. Copy. Alright. Okay. And one more. And I should be done. If not, probably give it to Joe. Okay, just setting the controls. I know what it was. Apparently, there is a parent ROM issue, so that's why. The thing that I thought was the case was the case. Hmm. Okay. Challenge. Time to actually. I'm not gonna say that. Nope. And to actually play the video game is what you were about to say, right, Taro? Mm. Right, Taro? 
Okay, let's go. Right. Yeah, right. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Alright. Let's hope this one doesn't cause issues. This video game is for. Oh, god damn it, you'll skip that. When I, t when I type in. I don't in, even know which one is which. When I type in Puzzle Bobble and I see Azumanga Dio Puzzle Bobble. Man. I hate puzzle games, but if there is ever a more convincing game to get me into puzzle games, that might be it. I gotta start <laughs> playing. I gotta I think start grinding out to Manga Dio Puzzle Bobble. <laughs> I, th uh, I think he opened story mode. Okay. All right, we're seeing the pre. We're seeing the pre-match conditioning. He's hitting He's him with less than three to mentally condition him to play him less seriously. <sighs> Flin Try Flin the with the. I don't know. Flinjo with the psychology. Yeah, okay. Alright. There see. it is. <laughs> Bubblin. I love that name, Bubblin. Alright, they're definitely puzzle gaming. I don't know what the fuck is going on because it's a puzzle game, but. Uh, oh, trust definitely... me, I can't, I can't commentate this sh this for shit. Like, hey, dude, the I'll start. Possible tournament happened, and I'm just like, the fuck do I say they're now? De they're definitely puzzle gaming, and you can't, you can say that they're doing, they're not doing a lot of things, and they are doing a lot of things. They're definitely puzzle gaming. Well, the goal of puzzle bubble is to remove as much of the bubbles in the field as possible by matching at least three of the same color. But puzzle bubble four adds some stuff I'm not familiar with, so I can't commentate much here either. It has variation depending on the character you pick. Bobblin is just like the old, like the old uh, patterns from before. Just get them in order, like two of each every time, and then. You know, I'm remembering now. Can you tell that I'm distracted currently? Like, what did? No, that's wrong one. Okay. Yeah, I, I just see Joe. Fire a bubble and she's like bunk 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 bouncing back and forth. Just just make sure to connect the colors together. Three colors, more than three colors. And that's it. Oh yeah, now I remember. There is a one additional detail specifically for versus play. If you are able to knock down bubbles into the bottom into the bottom half of the screen whatever you knock down will be thrown into the other into the other player's side of the screen if you if you drop a whole chunk it will throw that whole chunk at the other person think of it like Puyo Puyo that, if you want if you want to think of it like that it's just a bit crazier okay. Ooh, I feel like, and this is completely from a novice perspective on all puzzle games, but I feel like Puzzle Bobble is a little bit more sh like strenuous because the cursor is so slow. Like you really have to make good choices at all times during the match, yeah, and I make continual bad ones, so I tend to lose even faster in Puzzle Bobble. No, you have to be basically uh, accurate with the aiming. Ah. Are we? That's game, right? For Flynn? <laughs> yeah, probably not. I have no, I have not the slightest fucking clue. I'm, I'm asking to make sure because we were having uh, desync issues with uh, Possible Bubble 2. What the hell is that? I don't know, these don't look like desyncs. No? No, it's 1-1 uh, one, one in rounds. Uh, if anyone can confirm. We are on the, or I was on the, uh, the, the press start menu, or screen. Oh, I was desynced. Look at me, I am desynced. Ah, spectator desynced. <coughs> that makes that's why a I ranked, lot, that's why I ranked That makes a lot more are, sense, I was very confused as to what was happening. That's why rank and detectors are all so important, cause like, you never know when there's desyncs and all that shit. You never know when there's crashes. Yeah, I you guess... don't even know when the, the spectators are the ones who desync. 
Yeah, that too. So then, like, you might think that the outcome of a match is invalid. When in reality it isn't, you just have to check the ranked match scores. That's why I always encourage people to use ranked matches during tournament. At spectator desync again. I'm just that gonna use, uh, I'm just gonna have I'm to, just uh, I'm gonna be honest, up. I've just been watching the stream because it's not like I'm gonna in real time commentate anything. I'm mostly just gonna like sit here and talk about like how I don't know anything about this game. I, I had two cases of a uh, spectator desync, so I'm just gonna watch it as well. I'm just gonna watch the stream uh. as well because better something than nothing. If you're going to allow puzzle games like this, you should add Soldan to your tournament rotation. Well, what again? The way, the way this works, Theo, is that the people that's, that request the tournaments for Saturday or Sundays, whatever, those games go into automatically into the 5 day uh, listings. So I don't request these. I don't add these. They add these. <laughs> so that's how it works. I'm impressed this match is still going. I would expect that uh, this game would have some kind of measure if they stop rounds from going too long. No. Uh, it does technically, in automatically dropping the, the bubble stem one by one tile, but it, if you're popping at the speed of sound and slows your opponent, you can go for a million years, I guess. Yes, I guess. In the main game, it pushes the border of the field down, it doesn't just add bubbles. This is gonna be our longest. I think this is gonna be our longest round. Never mind. I, I get. I guess I'm just wrong. I'm just. I'm just wrong. I'm just. You're just dead. I am just checking if I won on my end. Okay. I think Ju's character is expressing what he's feeling right now. I'm sure. You're dead. Uh, what the? F okay, no these things. Fuck. Okay, uh, uh, apparently I won on my end. Okay. On. I think it's spectator desync only, or yeah. I don't know. Who knows? Yeah, the stream is the stream is showing the same result. Yeah, pretty much. I also asked um, Joe if, if it's the same. If it's, if it's worth the same. Oh God damn it! I imagine current score is uh one out for me. Yeah, one zero for for Camion. Uh, uh, that shot That might be the end of round one. Maybe that maybe might not. could very well be the end of round one. Wait. Pause champ. You're just dead again. You're just dead. You're just dead again, Joe. I'm looking at that bar for garbage. No, you're just dead. Wait. He's living. Uh, he can still turn this around. Oh. It's like Puyo Puyo. It's all about the hype comeback in these versus games. Oh. Uh. Maybe Torao's the one dead, there's oh, one more man. large chunk of there, but... Yeah, no. Yeah, no, I, 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 I don't know what to say. <laughs> I don't know what to say, it's just chaotic. Well, it's a uh, death kind of game, man, so... Pretty much. If Oxnorth was here, he would probably own me in a, in a second, considering he's the puzzle game champion. I'm just okay at this. That's all I am. Uh, that's all she wrote, I guess. <laughs> that. All right, GG's. 
Yeah, we're just uh, making sure. So that's going to be too old to row. GG's, uh, Joe. Yeah. You're not bad. Not bad at all. It's just I had more luck with your NGs, I guess. <laughs> okay. Uh, so yeah, there's that. I mean, there's still... There's, Is it... Um, it's basically, I'm gonna spend for Conspiratorial and Ikigai Anna. Alright. Okay. Okay. What about the losers match? This is truly this is truly the most fifty fifty if it lands on like a Kusoge. Because like Ikigai knows a fair amount of Kusoge too. So no, easily... if he gets right if we if we get Ragnar guard he will just run I, I Oh yeah, I'm shit at Ragnar. That wouldn't be a one that I'd have advantage. Out of fighting one. Artifact. It doesn't that one is isn't that one susceptible to these things or am I thinking no, of the wrong one? Artifying two is susceptible to these things. Artifying one and three. Okay. okay. So. Artifying <laughs> one. Alright. What's I'm up just, for this one? I'm just making sure that Iki guys uh, made aware. Thomas. <sighs> oh. There was a tournament from the Spanish League Discord this i did well on this one the last time i competed so yeah uh if you guys should have the rom that's all i know In terms probably need to set my controls mm. some something something tells me that i that i'm pretty sure Ikigai guy knows this game oh he knows because he knows he knows, he knows oh yeah I, I was gonna say I'm I'm boned. He knows a bit of, of the game. I'm not sure how much he knows because this game is basically straight up footsies. So you don't have combos in this, but you have taunt leeches in this game. So if you taunt, you remove your opponent's power meter. And everything else is basically just straight up footsies. <laughs> With some ancient... Um, some ancient inputs. So. <laughs> uh, which DBZ game are you talking about, Retroaction? Are you talking about Z Z2 Battles? Z2 Battle? Oh, yeah. If that game gets picked, I'm banning the flurry of punches from um, Piccolo if you're player two. So, I mean. Z2 Battle isn't a bad game. Then again, I haven't played a bad game, so I don't know. I guess we're waiting for Icky Guy. Right. Yeah. Wait, what happened? I'll wait three minutes for Icky Guy. Uh, he, because Iki is also, uh, he's also in the, in the Spectral vs. Generation tournament. So I'm going to give him three minutes. Or you can just run the ones in Losers. Yeah. Losers is currently frozen over. Doesn't matter, I'll just delay the match. Uh, okay, so just keep this as uh, remembered, Thomas. It's uh, You and Nikki are gonna play the Art of Fighting 1 game. In the meanwhile, I'm gonna spin for the next match. Is that okay with you, Thomas? That's fine. Okay, thanks for letting me know. Alright, so losers is going to be uh, opponent versus Scotty. Actually, Theo is getting sick. Um, yeah. All right, let's try this. Winner gets to move on past Belgium because he's not come back. Yeah, eventually when I get there. Um. He'll he'll come back eventually. No, I don't think he'll come back eventually. We'll see. The real mark of the wars. Oh okay. I'll I'll keep it for for later. Apparently, you guys here. Okay. 
Oh. God damn it. No. It's okay, man. We'll, we'll resume with loser mat w w with the loser matches after winners because the way I do winners like the, the way I do the brackets I first do the winner matches then I do the losers matches then I do semifinals then loser then grand finals so all right they're in good luck have fun so yeah it's um. It's Art of Fighting, it's uh, Art of Fighting 1 uh, for Ikigai Anon vs. Cosplay Toy. Oh, fuck. Mr. Karate, two boss characters. Let's go. For some reason, I could beat Art of Fighting 1 with save states, but I couldn't beat Art of Fighting 2 with save states. On the PS2. Because apparently Geese wants to cheat. Alright. Iki when get and takes uh, round 1 with a ring jackpot. Nice. Oh man. Finish. Nobody's banned in this game? No. No one's banned in this game. Not that I know of. The last tournament we played, there was no mention of bans for this for any character. And there was like in the Spanish League this game. And in Honestly, it's probably one of those situations where literally nobody gave a shit for there to be rules. Like, it's like DBZ2. We don't even know who these characters are. We're gonna just allow them in. Who cares? Yeah. I mean, it's boss versus boss. It doesn't really matter. Yeah. Bench, man. Whoever is good, we win. I came back just in time for the boss character gaming that's happening. Yeah. I mean, the boss characters aren't banned initially, so it doesn't really matter. So these guys are called Mr. Karate in later games. Look at all the karate taking place right now. <laughs> All this, all this karate, all this, all this kicking, all this punching, but there's not a single projectile been thrown yet. There has been, though. I mean, kind of coming from there, like... For this round. For this round. Yeah. Alright, AT guy Anon takes it to... Oh, GG's. <laughs> okay, uh, time to move on to loser, to the loser matches. So... Finally. Finally right. So, just a moment, let me just uh, input the score, and I'll tell you which game. I'll, I'll tell you in the chat. So, uh, Theo versus Scuddy. Sorry you waited that, uh, this long. Alright, so... Is Scuddy around? 
He is in the Discord. He should be around. Unless he's offline. No, he's online. Alright, Garou, Mark of the Wolves. Really? Yeah. Garou, Mark of the mm, I spawned it before... Um, uh, before... Iki guy said he was ready for his match. FT2. I guess today is popular day. <laughs> I have the game, so you can start whenever. Got a little mark of the... Mark of no, the I need wolves. to set my buttons now, first. Uh, and I apologize for this wording. Got a little mark of the Brazilians. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, should, you should say mark of the South Americans, because most people, most South Americans play mostly... SMB I just felt like... I, I just felt... <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I just felt like saying that. That's okay. You can say whatever you want. Dude, so someone from Brazil is gonna hear that and it's gonna fucking just. Okay, You're an asshole. Ready. All right. Uh. Hey, but right now the games haven't been that bad. We had a few Kusogi titles, but I'm guessing we're gonna have more Kusogi titles. A few puzzle games. Two puzzle games, right? Yes. Technically two puzzle games. Yes. It's both puzzle bubble and then This Act is another Attack. game I don't know at all. Me neither. I just know that Terry is in this game and I suck at and it. I don't know a character, I just pick random select. <laughs> I guess. Yeah. I guess. Isn't this like an obscure game though? I mean, uh, like it's. It is obscure. It is obscure. But I just call it Kusoga so I can feel good about myself. <laughs> no, no, it's okay. Like, it <laughs> so was... I can feel good about how people uh, kick my ass. It was no, Kusoga. Like, it, it... Here's the thing it was Kusoga a few years ago. I don't think it's Kusoga anymore because there has been a big resurgence where people meet and like a lot of people play it. I think when um, when they released it on Steam, when Roy got it, on Steam, it Okay. Yeah, people were playing it again when they came back for that. This is basically a game. Or, yeah. It's a it's a fade up your game, technically. Yeah. Well, yeah. Because that's where this is placed. Like, in terms of timeline, it, it's like. KOF and Fatal Fury are two separate timelines for specifically Terry. Yeah. So this is just this is following down the path of Fatal Fury. This, this is more of a real bad game, uh, Fatal Fury game. I mean, there is one game I want uh, to see. Although Hotato, Hotato we, is pretty good. Although we have seen it in uh, previous uh, mystery cards. And that's British Revenge Extra Mode. Dude, I think there's at least one person who fucking broke a controller over Breakers See, this Revenge Extra. Hops. Okay, so Scotty takes uh, match one. Is there one? I, I, I like what's been said in chat. Hotaro is super good. Beach, uh, Janet is, has nice, nice baps. Rock is the worst character in the game. Despite being the coolest design, which I hate it. I hate this game for that, but no, I'm kidding. I, I I don't like that he is the coolest design, but the worst character in the game. Uh, oh, I misread that. Uh, Marco is the most fun, and Griffin has a sick command grab. Yeah, Marco. But still, what the what the fuck they do in a rock? He's a he's one of the cooler designs of this game, and they're like, let's make him low tier. Yeah, he is right there, unfortunately. I mean, people play him, but I think that the most people play with are what? Um, Gato. Gato? Possibly, possibly Kuzero. Not sure who else. Oh yeah, the Zoner. Which can be unlocked. If you know certain fucking commands, the correct characters. 
there, there's also another thing uh, that I know about this game is uh, how just defense work. Any you can just defend, and I believe it's reduce reduce recovery time for the moves, aka just standard just defend from guilty gear and that. But also any successful just defend will give you some health back, and. And in some way that does also apply with top. Like if you do a just defend and your uh, reduce recovery time, reduce chip and, re and meter gain, and also health health gain also I believe. Uh, top in also being just like it's one of them. Yeah, I imagine it's both. I imagine it's both. But it's reduce chip, reduce uh, reduce recovery time, health gain, and maybe meter gain. We're confused on that one. And then there's also uh, the top-in system, which is basically you get one extra move, I guess, per character, and a few other attributes that I can't remember. And one of them is automatic health recovery if you're within top-in, or if you're within uh, within where you place the top portion of your health bar, like. The the the. Have no uh, 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 Ooh. Alright. Scotty knows what he's doing. GG's. Kinda. But. Yeah, that's uh, all too This game. This, right. this game's weird. Uh. I'm not gonna lie. Well. <laughs> Tech. In, in a way, I it just is weird. Jew's message and picked the character I didn't want to pick. Oh well. Alright, so Did... let's see. Uh, Mahmoud you... Cab versus Coast Jam is next. So I'm gonna... Who are you trying to Who are you trying to pick? Opponent. I wanted to Hello? go with the command grab. Oh you wanted to <laughs> You brought you wanted to pick the wrestler. <laughs> oh Tizak, okay. Alright, so, or aka King of Dinosaurs, which is known in Killer 15. Alright. No, uh, right. those two are different characters. Go Jem, your match is gonna be next, so hopefully it's a game you like. Give me a puzzle game, I saw he's on Wi Fi and he's too far away. Sorry, no such thing. Rabbit. Why do you give me the. Oh my god, I That's hate not this a puzzle game. game. I don't actually like. I, this is, I would have had a better chance with this game, frankly. This is no cafe, this is. This is not. This is Coach Jim being serious. I fucking hate this game. So the thing that's and trashy is an uh, in a an incredible rabbit defender, but the thing that's I, I understand. Rabbit, I, I, I thing understand that there's people. Yeah, it's like, a pretty. It, it, it's a pretty don't. looking. It's a pretty looking game. That's like the. the it lacks a fucking crouch hit animation. So there's so many fucking infinites. Like there's so many jump it infinites. <laughs> Like, I found, like, four on my own before I decided to go even look at a combo video, and they're all really dog shit easy, too. So, like, it's literal just, like, day one infinite, block these mixes, and then that's pretty much it. It's it's really shallow game. All just completely in my opinion, but I it's share the, the rabbit hatred. Really, the main reason, the actual main reason is I fucking hated the audio, and some of the characters, it grossed me out. Yeah, I presume the Saturn port didn't fix any of those problems. <laughs> Very much. Uh, wait, there's a Santa porn? Yeah. Jim yeah, there is. Obviously. Oh. Published by EA, of all people. God damn it, EA. No. By uh, EA, EA Japan's short lived EA existence. Japan only. A fighting game with cartoon graphics. <laughs> okay. I would expect okay. EA to do digitized fighting like everyone else in America at the time. You'll get yours eventually. Uh,. EA. Oh, wait, you, shout you out to, did. shout out to the best, uh, <laughs> the best EA fighting game, NHL '95. All right, no, uh, we're not doing. I mean, rabbit. NHL '94. No, we're we're '94 is the one everyone plays. Co uh, Coach Jam. Oh, we're, we're '93. We're I don't not know doing anymore. rabbit. Uh, I just, wait, what did I say? Save. I think, was it? I'm, I thought it was NHL PA '93 and '94. I just remembered that this game runs like dog. Oh. Uh. 
I yeah, just, I, 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 I just remembered that this game runs really bad, and I'm going to remove this game mostly yeah. because of that. Um, and because the person that, that, that suggested isn't here anymore, so who gets the fucking axe? No one likes it, no one wants to like it, and... It was it? Like I have a question. I have a question. Who was it that, that suggested Rabbit? I want to know. Uh, who is Koss. The, uh, who is it was the... Koss. Yes, yes, it was the guy. I can't remember him. Yeah, yeah. Unfortunately, uh, sorry, Cassinari, but uh, the thing is, this game runs bad. I'm gonna remove it. Yeah, sorry. No, uh, uh, no offense to you, but it's it's getting the fucking axe. Uh, it's getting the axe. I know there's no. I know there. I know there's a rule against trash. Uh, no insulting and no any of that. But no, 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 no. Yeah. It, all right. I don't know. Wait, Cardinal? Oh, better. I, I actually want to. This is actually better, actually. Kind of, yeah. sort of. Yeah, it's going to be mostly but... because, like, I ran Rabbit once, and due to how. You didn't runs, like it. No, no, no. It's not about. Uh, like, it's a good game, but. Uh, the fact that it runs choppy almost on every connection is worrying. And so I don't want to put something that runs. Like shit from the get go, so no. Carnival's Revenge, then. Alright, Mahmoud versus Coach Jam. Right. Am I allowed to coach? You can do Dude, you I'm can. just gonna pick Ray and throw <laughs> fireballs. What else do you want from me? You know what? That was my coaching. You're good. You're in there. You're right in the pocket. I'm glad my coaching worked. <laughs> the co the best coaching is the one that never happens. I mean, fuck, dude. If if both players don't know the game, he's got like a half screen DP and a really fucked up fireball. If the if one of the, and if one of the players knows the game, then any character you pick is gonna like not matter anyway. So. Yeah, he's not in here anyways, so it doesn't really matter. Goss Gossinari is not here. Everything is a moot point. Well, I imagine he left. I imagine he left on his own accord because he totally. Ah, I hear the sounds of. He's pro. He's probably here on one of his alts. Yes, he is actually. He's on the. Yeah, okay. He's on the Discord, but he is in the channel. Hope he's well. You know, that's all. That's all I'm gonna say. Oh right, I forgot I muted the audio, thinking we were gonna play grab it. No, it's okay. Don't worry about it. No, uh, there is one game I wish it would get suggested again, mostly because I want it to be picked for for the uh, mystery tournament, and that's a game uh, that's near and dear to me, Dynamax. No, mm. I will not. Dynamax. No, I will. De I will DQ myself. All right. So, ever... coast. Yeah. So, coast jam. Here's the thing. You got to make sure that B doesn't hear about this, and you got to make sure that Alex doesn't hear about this. Cause they will. They already know Dynarex. my opinion towards it. Well, no. I mean, they'll they'll hear they'll uh, they'll hear about the request to tournament, dude. You, we got to suppress this. We have to like we have to hide Dynarex from everyone. Yeah, but it's a good game. I don't know what you have against. Uh, just, I, it, it, I don't dis I don't dislike Dino Rex per se. It just gives me an intense headache when I play it. Like, oh, because of the audio. Yeah, but the audio is. The best yeah, the odd. The audio is so. I guess I could just put it on mute or put it on speakers, but on headphones, it is actually like blood curdling. Uh, wait, Would I rather play Dino Rex or Bloodstorm? Bloodstorm, probably. Mmm, I don't know. I I know less about Bloodstorm than I do about Dino Rex because I've actually like labbed out Dino Rex and it's, okay. it's actually a lot like Street Fighter 1. Okay. You just do one move and then that one move invalidates everything else. It's okay, so like it's actually a really simplistic meta. Oh, what were you going to say, Charlo? It's okay, Constantine. My neutral. I am going to add Primal Rage eventually when PS1 gets rolled back. And it is going to get rolled back. I am. I am. Uh, I'm almost not. Now, I'm primal. Ready. I'm almost. Primal one. Rage is like. I don't. I don't like every mechanic in that game. 
but it's a much better game than Dinorex. And that this is coming from a Dinorex supporter. I love Dinorex. It just you play it once every like seven years or something, and then lock it away into like a fucking cavern somewhere. When we did the uh, when we did casual events of Thunderia, we would uh, play Dinorex on occasion. So there is another user, I forgot his name. I'll probably remember him once he uh, comes back again, but he also liked the Because there is a good- When I played- there Oh, we're gonna- I was my about bad. to fucking say, if I can't break or am I just stupid? Because it took a while <laughs> to actually give me the point. It actually took a while to give me the point. Well, I'm gonna oh yeah, that's the that's safe. the detector. That's the detector. It takes a long time yeah, for uh, uh, Karnovs. You have to hit like the the character select. Please tell me he doesn't know about balloons. Also, when also when um when I did the drunken round robin of uh, of Dino Rex, when I was talking it over by council with the other Dino Rexers. We decided that like first to two was more than enough for any set of Dino Rex because it will mentally destroy you to play like first to three in like a six man round robin will literally cook your mind. Well, yeah, that was my fear. I, I think you're exaggerating. No, no, I'm not. It will give you like a really bad feeling. <laughs> You'll not feel good. Like, when I play Dino Rex too much, I get like a weird inner ear feeling where I feel really dizzy. I don't know, I played Dino Rex for 30 minutes and didn't I played like an hour and 45 minute set of Dino Rex, so maybe that was the problem there. Yeah, okay. You've been too exposed, I guess, to the goodness that is Dino Rex. It's... It, it's a... I, it was a fun. It's like violence fight, except violence fight doesn't inflict mental horror on you. By the way, while you guys were arguing, it, while, while you guys were arguing about, uh... oh, this is classic Thundaria Jesus. commentary, dude. Yeah, we we know you won, dude. We're just we we always bans. Yeah, yeah it, it was close. I'm yeah, not gonna lie. Yeah, we rant basically. We rant about the the most ridiculous Kusogi titles that we've ever done. And unfortunately, Dinorex is just the tip of the iceberg. It's not even the worst. <laughs> I mean, oh yeah, I was gonna say, I was gonna say, Violence Fight was like Dinorex in the sense like um, they're both relatively incredibly simple games, easy to figure out. I, I think if, I, if we're gonna talk about Dinorex, I think the only thing that I find funny about Dinorex is whenever you accidentally cross up the opponent, both dinosaurs just go. Fuck me, I guess. I gotta go back to my uh, side of the screen. Yeah, they both reset. They both reset. They're like, meh, fuck it, I guess. Go I know exactly I guess what you're talking about. Go Shem, are you ready? Huh? You ready? Uh, yeah. Alright. Yeah, so I'm gonna spin the wheel. Spin the wheel. Alright. Let's see what we get. Let's see what you get. Give me Karnov again. Uh, Give me Karnov again. You can get Karnov again. <laughs> yeah, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I know, I know you remove it. I already hit the best possible outcome I could get. I went two. Oh, and no, I, I'm at least good. guaranteed for two and two. That's KOF that's all I can three. hope for. in RNG is fifty percent. Ooh, KOF two thousand three. Ooh, yeah. ooh, KOF two thousand three. A, a, a finicky year, a fun year though. There's a lot of non-fun oh, year fun. enjoyers. You know, I I enjoy the fun years of KOF. Yeah, I mean they're all fucked up. <laughs> what I refer to as the fun years are all fucked up, but they're they're cool. Just think, uh, KOF 03 is my second favorite uh, KOF. Second favorite. Yeah. Yeah. Mostly because of you know I I is. really I really like Neo Wave and everybody hates Neo Wave. Really? <laughs> but it's like it's the K it's the KOF that I grinded a bunch growing up. So like I don't know I just like it. I thought everyone hated Mira. Can someone send Mira? me uh, what, what maximum impact? Following. Can, can someone send me the wrong? The the auto downloader is not doing anything. Okay, I'll uh, I'll I'll send you. It's open for me anyway. It's just uh, search for KOF 2003 or 03 or anything above, because this is what I'm using. This is like the quickest method right now. Um. So yeah, search for it. It's in alphabetical order, so don't worry about it. Hmm. 
Yeah, because I also have to get it. Now, all three is this game fast. Is, is fast and really fun, man. Like I really can't stress enough how how much I loved that <clears> game. <throat> I love that game in a tournament format because every time, because I only play games in a tournament format. I mean, Thomas knows this. <laughs> Yeah. But yeah, Mira Mira would be nice if it had rollback. <laughs> then people wouldn't have to use Farsight to all PCs. Oh yeah. Yeah. I've heard good things about well, maximum impact. Well here's the thing. The way I've, I've never seen Mira, I've never super gotten into it though. The way I see Mira is if Tekken and Scale have had a baby. That's basically it, how I see it. Because for me, Mera is like the best KOF game. It's like you have uh, you have a bunch of options actually. And the only uh, the the only scenario where a Metal Slug character is like top tier. Wait, say that again. Uh, I said it's the only case where a Metal Slug character is top tier in that game. What game? Uh, KOF Mira. Or Maximum Impact Regulation A. It's, we call it Mira for short. It's KOF Mira. I want to see who's this, who this Metal Slug character is. And if it's not Theo or Marco, I'm going to lose it. I mean, the regulars are there, but um, there are some new faces. You know, the, the funny thing is, is how I personally was asking myself, hmm, I wonder if there's if there's a uh, if there's a fighting game with a Metal Slug character, and it's just like, oh, well, there's uh, KOF of Mira. It's just like, well, I I guess I got the answer to the question. Just... I mean, if she can outrange you anytime she fucking wants. <laughs> It's like you have the you you have the option to roll, you have the option to sidestep, you have the option to fucking run. So what's not the love? What's not the love? <laughs> okay. Uh, I got the ROMs, so I'm just pasting them where I need to paste them. I am currently uh, waiting for the other ROM. Yeah. Because I downloaded uh, KOF 2003 and 2003 H, in, just in case it requires. Yeah, I'm downloading the other one. Just, just in case it requires a pat run. So I'm more. very confused as to why it froze like that, but whatever. Hmm. Uh. It's gonna give me some time. I'm to... getting challenged and no, no, fuck off. Fuck, fuck off, cost. Fuck, fuck, no, out. Out. No, I don't want to play you. No. Dude, I don't. If he sends me a third challenge, I will fucking yell at him. <laughs> okay, this is it. <laughs> oh no, he, he, he's very much doing it to, uh, to fucking piss me off. Never mind. Screw that. Uh, or see ignore feature. There it is. Ignore. There we go. Don't have to deal with him anymore. I, he took very much offense to the one day that I told him you weren't about the word. I, I I had a short conversation with him after he got kicked from another server, and I told him Enjoy you this. went about the worst way possible to hide yourself from everyone else. And then he took, and I guess he took offense to that, and now he hates me. Which, fair enough. Fair enough. I hate myself too. Didn't Casaneri antagonize a bunch of people, though? Uh, he. Yes. Technically. Kinda. Sorta. I don't. I wouldn't really be able to be the one to say that, but I. But if you want to, if you want a very definite answer to your question without me answering your question. No, no, no. Um, he no, basically. I was just, I was just, uh, <laughs> Without without going into great detail on the whole thing, 
that. He said a lot of homophobic and transphobic shit. That's that's really the worst thing he did. Anyway. Okay. Now you. Joe's ready. Uh, you can send me a challenge now, Joe. Mama. No, nobody. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, first to two or first to three? First to two. Uh, I'm, I'm okay. keeping the regular format, though, like in the arm first arm to three, first to two the whole way. Yeah, I mean it's not about the whole way or not. Uh, Kira two thousand three is quicker than all the other ones, so <laughs> you'll see soon. I can't say. Oh my, my bad. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm I'm sorry in that case. Okay. I, I lost my cursor. Where? Where is? I literally lost my cursor. Yeah, well, one of the franchises that we have on home while tournaments. <laughs> it's almost every week on no. Thomas. I should honestly like start playing more KOF. Yeah, yeah that's who got out of KOF. KOF is like I, I don't know, it it always felt hard to get into KOF stateside because I don't know, where I live people play like greedy and like Capcom game shit like that. It's not really <laughs> Yeah, essentially. Soul Calibur was there a little bit too, and so was um, some other games, but yeah. It's and then she, she. Oh, what were we going to oh, say? Oh, wow, that's, my bad. that's uh, I'm dead. Uh, I guess. Fun fact King of Fighters 98 came out on my ninth birthday. So I feel a responsibility to at least know a little about it. I don't. Yeah, the only thing I know about King of 98 is. is that. It's one of those balance that I've played. And it's quite Wait, fast. I forgot. Does Terry have- Oh my god, I'm... never mind. Forget I- I've Forget heard I asked. good things about UM. I've heard good things about, like... Uh... Shit, what was the other one? 14? And I've heard... Uh... Actually, I haven't heard much of anything about 14. I think it's kind of in sleep mode because it's net code kind of makes it hard to play. Um. Yeah. Although, but yeah, but KOF 13, I feel like uh, actually no, not I'm biased. I'm gonna say I'm gonna say something dumb. I was. It, it's probably more that I was just more active in the FGC when KOF 13 was around. I think KOF 13 had. Good visuals, but they ruined the. Oh, was it Rolf and I'll say KOF 13. It's not a bad design choice, but like, it's definitely. It's up there with like Vampire Saviors as games that I can't imagine playing now because I play too many games. And if I wanted to focus on only those games, I'd have to probably play only those games. Like I don't, I can't imagine I could be good at KOF 13 and play like legitimately anything else. Yeah. It's just too hard of a game. It's like probably one of the hardest games. Uh, Guilty Gear. Guilty Gear is not too bad, no. but I also. I also had anime players to play with and shit, so I, I get the concept of anime, I, SNK games, it's still like... I know some of the goofy ones, but I don't really know any of the other ones. Speaking of which, I got an in- uh, oh yeah, I told you this. Got the, uh... Got the games for this week. It's gonna be fun. Playing Ragnarok again. Hell yeah, Ragnarok's been getting run a 
good bit, I think. Yeah. Same as same with SVG. Because uh, Ragnarok had like, um, I had a fist fight in a movie tournament, and then Polar Bear and Alex ran a tournament for it together. Like, but then it kind of went in sleep mode for a while, so it's cool to see people run shit for it again. I'm just. I'm sad. out. I'm just sad the top fighter. Um, yeah. GG's man, you did well in the tournament. Uh, oh, yeah. the top fight. The top I'm not fighter take that work. away, but. But like, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna yeah. say, dude, top fighter, best game of all time. Yeah, that was Yeah. Hell yeah! I was there for the tournament. It didn't run correctly. Yeah. I but know. I thought it was funny because I beat two people while I was desynced anyway. I was like, how the fuck did that happen? All right, conspiratorial. Uh, you ready? All right, me versus Scuddy. Scuddy, yep. Let's go. All right. Let's see. Let's see what shenanigans you're gonna get. I just can't believe I got into semifinals. I'll, I'll be honest with you. All right, give me, give me Street Fighter the movie. <laughs> give me survival arts. Give me, give me Joy Mech fight. Give me a uh... fighter's history dynamite. Did you run this? Already? Give me Fighting Masters. Fighting Masters would be really fun to play. I'd love to play fighters, some Fighting uh, Masters. Fighter's history dynamite. Wasn't that played earlier? No, Fighters history no, no. dynamite. That's just that's just Karnovs, but I mean we can play that. I don't give a shit. I'll play Karnovs. Mm. That's all that's all Fighters History Dynamite is though. Is it's Karnovs. Exactly they're the, the same. same. Yeah, they're, that's the same name and they have I'm, it's I'm either fine Karnovs with that. Revenge no, 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 of no, no, Fighters. No, 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 no. Hold on, hold on, Thomas. I didn't I did not know about this. Fighters History Dynamite oh, okay. and Karnovs Revenge are the same game with the, with a different name, right? Yeah, they're yeah. the exact same uh, game, just different yeah. name. Respin. It's basically a regional Respin. difference. Okay, yes. alright, respawn's fine. Go for it either way. Hey, whatever everyone wants to do. Okay. Thank you for correcting me, I did not know about that. You're about to jump into Karnov's Revenge again. Uh, well, we've got the next review, but I gotta check first to see if it's... Uh... If it's not a fucking SNES, because I'm not sure. It's not an SNES game. No, it Gundam is. EX no, review works. I can 100% tell like you this that. this to be a Super Nintendo game of the day. Alright, so yeah. So that's going to be Mobile Suit Gundam X review. I know this because I know Dimax, and Dimax likes this game. Yeah, Actually, that's legitimately... No, like is an under... Saying that he likes this game is an undersell. He actually loves this game. And yeah. he will... Tr and he... I think in Sajin's Discord, he occasionally asks, who wants to play a uh, mobile EX Revenue? I go in, and no one I, answered. I joined the Sajin Discord to do the first Kuso Cup with um with Dimax, and uh, I go into the Looking for Games channel now, and I just like Slugma want Kuso sometimes. All right, I'm gonna I just guess. randomly do it. I don't ever expect anyone to actually want to play Kuso game, but hey. Ask Maybe me I'll anything about this someday. game, and I'll tell you my, to the best of my ability. Do you like this game, or are you just being ironic about it? I play this game in the bi-weeklies every two weeks. I'm an Ak guy player, but I've been picking up Zagok lately because he has a really stupid attack that's funny as shit. I've also dabbled in Dolmel. Yeah, I know. You tell me any- you ask me anything, I'll probably be able to help you. I- I- uh, all I remember is that there was one of the car Gundams that were actually stronger than the other characters. Actually, no. That, that, that's about how I put it. Uh, there was, in a way, there, there's the regular version of the Gundam, and there is in a Cars version of uh, a Chars or Car. I don't know how to pronounce it. But basically, there's uh, basically yeah. two versions of the same character, and they changed drastically. Yeah, the uh, the Zagok, which is probably one of the worst characters in the game normally, the Zaku and the uh, the Gelgoog, all have Shar Aznable variants, the red ones, and they play completely differently with the same sprites. And usually the yeah. Shar versions are better. Alright, they're in. <sighs> better or provide something, uh, provide something over the originals. Yeah, they just so... they make more sense. Um, Zagok's one of the worst characters in the game. He has no combos. Uh, the only thing he has going for him is that one of his attacks is invincible. Um, I don't know about Shars though, but um, Gun Cannon's stupidly good. 
gun cannon, that move right there, that crosses up. And uh, this game has a problem with cross-ups where if you do them too low to the ground, they become unblockable. So, like, there's this, uh, this one new player, Lily. Um, she's been playing with gun cannon where um, she'll time it out just right so that when you're standing up, you have no choice but to eat that unblockable. Other than that, he's basically Sagat. Tiger knee, high shot, low shot. I guess we're playing Mighty Warriors, huh? A low kick on <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> there, there's one other main aspect of the game, uh, apart from the actual gameplay stuff. If you look at the bottom corners, you see uh, directional inputs from both players. Yeah, you can read inputs. It, it's fucked up. I mean, you can play without looking at it, but... Uh, no, you should definitely way... look at it. Be a, moon t be a new type. That's, uh, that's yeah, actually but... a completely valid, legitimate strategy in this game, is looking at the input reader. Yeah, and it usually leads to more elaborate gameplay, looking yeah. at the input reader, because so like, you can trick sorry. someone into jumping. Yeah, like, I'm a, I'm an act guy player, and he's a charge character. So what I'll do half the time is I'll hold down back when the round's about to start, making them think I'm going to charge, and then just walk up and throw. Like, you could do all sorts of stupid stuff. So, I actually, you I like had a great... I know I played it with a couple of the Windjammers guys, specifically Warp Whistle and and uh, Rune, and I had a fucking blast with this game. I love this game. This game's incredible. So, um, know, thing uh, about this game with uh, Gundam, though, you gotta watch out. Gundam's got a projectile in quarter circle. He's got a really, really slow move on half circle forward, and the overlap is real. So if you see him pull out that stupid uh, Gundam hammer, the ball and chain, it's probably a missed input trying to get a fireball. But yeah, right yeah. there, that was unblockable. So, Joe, Thomas out uh, here popping. How are you liking the tournament so well, far? Huh? Uh, I asked Joe, uh, how are you liking the tournament so far? Oh, me? No, I'm having a blast. I'm having a great time. I always do. <laughs> I had no idea what I was doing in Puzzle Bobble, though. That was wild. Yeah, see, that was a missed input. Yeah, it's okay. You did more, though. Anytime I get a puzzle game in Mystery Games, I'm just like, fuck! <laughs> so what do you think about the joystick displays in the corners making it impossible to hide your inputs from the other player? No, I think no, it works we, out! We said that before, we said that before, it's like, you can actually trick someone into thinking that you're about to do something, GG's. but don't well just do it, just something else. Wait, I'm so the, whole real, thing, uh, uh, the whole thing with Gundam is that people get psychic powers in Gundam when they're flying around in space and it makes them better pilots, because they know what's happening. So the fact that this game has that in some weird way where you can read your opponent's inputs, it's kind of cool. Yeah, you can I, you can pick. I, uh, I think it was way. I think it was Cars Saku. I, the head. Well, they both have fireball, but uh, I'm, I'm thinking more Cars Saku since that's my default go to. You can. I feel do, so uh, sensitive to the fact that I am a masher when people can see that I'm mashing. Joe, Thomas, you can. Are you ready? Uh, <laughs> You ready? You can basically yes. fake a uh, fireball input. What's, yeah, yeah, yeah. Spin, spin her up, dog. Go. And, uh, the regular Zaku has a missile projectile that yeah, like shoots low to the ground. That hits low. Yeah, uh, yeah. I know they Thomas. both had a projectile. I just went to Kar's Zaku since oh, that's my go-to. Yeah, no, Shar's Zaku's really good. Oh, look, the one game that was made in... Oh, Rage of the Dragons like were... Uh, yeah. Ooh. Really? I like the. I like. Yeah. I, I'm gonna read it. All we're right. hitting the whole. We're hitting the whole poverty FGCF. We went from Dimax. Now we're going we're just, to Roy Shark. Roy would be having a would be having a time of his life right now, knowing that there's more people playing Rage of the Dragons. But he's a interesting in, interesting tidbit that I was told. Uh, there was a case where. One of the Rage of the Dragon devs challenged one, uh, I think it was one SNK employee. I don't know, I don't remember the exact uh, position of this person. But to put simply, they said, if you win, we let you publish this game under the SNK umbrella. If we win, you do the same thing, but we get to design a character. And the Rage of the Dragon dev actually won. So, if you wanted to know why Angel is a character, there you go. The Rage of the Dragon devs actually were the re are the reason Angel exists as a character. Rage of the Dragons is downloading for me, but it's taken a grip. 
It's just the server that the Don't worry about my JSONs are like downloading from. Yeah, it might it might be a minute or two. I think that's one of the big file size Neo Geo games too. It's okay, man. Don't worry about it. I mean, that's why I'm using uh, Mega. I don't bother with the fucking JSONs when I am uh, in the fucking Mr. Tournament, so I don't ha so, I, so people don't have to wait on me. No, but right now, tournament wise, <laughs> I mean matches wise, we we haven't had a really straight up bad um, Persuya game, not yet. I think the worst that we could possibly land on is gold next to the duel. I think that's the worst thing. I wouldn't say it's bad, but it it's a beat 'em up. That has that has a fighting game mode. That's it. That's it. That's like the worst game for you guys. Hmm. Uh, is the match started? Uh, um, Thomas is downloading the um, the Rage of the Dragon from via the JSON, and the JSON is a bit slow. So, yeah. Yeah. It's usually how it goes. But yeah, Red Jesus Dragon. Particular is good. server must be a slow one. Yeah. Well, maybe you want to get it faster. You want me to give you the link? Yeah, go ahead and give me the link too. Yeah. I might end up uh, having the download finish, but it also might take forever too, so. We don't know. Sometimes uh, Jason takes like 15 minutes to download a file, so. Just... Yeah. Okay, so they're in alphabetic order, so just find the exact ROM name. I mean, you should be an expert at this. Yeah, R O T T. Yeah. U W went too far. S. Oh, there's R. So what do you think of the, um, about the uh, mystery tournament format, Kucha? I it, it's been fun so far. Even if even if I lost in a game, I don't know. You know that's that's part of the charm. Just I mean, playing a game that you don't know, I mean, even if the other person might. I mean, the point is there is no preparation for this. You know, you can't practice a game that you don't know what you're gonna get, especially when the list is like 150 games or close to 150 <laughs> games. <laughs> Then again, something tells me we'll get new games because I have to test about four games after this tournament. So I have to add stuff like two puzzle games and two fighting games. Mm, Tower so something. Thread. There is a fighting game called so Tower something. I have to check. Let's see. Tournament I'm two. good. Uh, I'm good. Whenever now I've got the ROM. Right. Didn't challenge uh, your opponent. Yep, I did. Mm. Okay, let me just join. Oh, we're good. He's accepting. All right, let's go. All right. Now I'm going to, I'm gonna probably hard disappoint my co high with this one, cause like, um. I don't, I don't fucking know this game, but he does. It's one of the few like really obscure games that he actually plays. It's an SNK He's really game. good at it. It's an SNK game. Play it like an SNK game. Get us who got at Rage of the Dragon. I, I can, I can try, translate on the spot. Oh, there's air guard? Okay. We anime, I guess? I think it's just projectile air guard, not really... Ah. Any. I imagine oh, it's no. an air projectile block. I don't think it's any... Okay, never mind, I take it back. I think, uh, Jimmy and Makoto, though. Jim, Jimmy and Billy, or whatever the name of the other character was. But... 
basically, them two are the Shoto archetype for this game. Or the character, the characters that would fall under the Shoto Khan archetype. Oh, I could have had a wall bounce combo there. That that would have been one of the moments where my Kohai would be fuming. Be like, how the fuck could you miss that? We play this game like on FC1 before. You're getting oh. FC1, yeah, the, the olden days. Last time I used FC1, no one could connect to each other basically. Oh, okay. oh fuck. I don't even know the super input. You don't want to tell people that. Why not? <laughs> for no, for a mystery, <laughs> no, for a mystery <laughs> tournament, that is incredibly valid fucking advice. Just mash for a mystery tournament is straight up like if you don't know the game, you might as fucking well. Like that's straight up like actual advice. I mean, here's the thing, the dinner tournaments are not known to be competitive, so... <laughs> Me saying them mashing was basically... Yeah, <laughs> I mash buttons, so... <laughs> just flexed on his way out. Large man and fat man versus Shoto and... I don't know what archetype uh, Lin is. Oh, that traded? What the fuck? That man's dying against the wall, he's getting... He, he, I'm looking at the wrong thing. Whoops. <laughs> ooh, 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 ah. Why? Oh, why? <laughs> why? Why does he have a T-pose as an anti-air move? <laughs> Team, yeah, I love that move. That move's so silly. Alright, and he is dead. It... Lin said your T-Pose means nothing to me. Uh, Dick Buster above both brother. <laughs> Alright. What the fuck? Max still goes for oh. Oh. We're getting close to the end there. Uh, I think this is the last match before sending the charger. Possibly, I'm not sure. The Shoto Brothers? Don't bother. Don't bother. <laughs> I like the broken English. <laughs>
Oof. That man ran in, he said, tag me in, just knocked the taste out of his mouth, and he's gone. Tag me in, bro. Let me in. Now we have, once again, uh, Brickbuster Abobo's brother, Abubo. He, he went, it, this is his brother, instead of going to Double Dragon, he went to here. He said, "I'm gonna make a, I'm gonna make an honest living by punching people in the face." This is going down very much to the wire. Thomas is one character with more health than both of uh, Joe's head characters. And now, now it's down, down, down one to one in characters. Oh. Slash rounds, but we don't talk about that. Just wake up soon. Uh, drop kick for the win. GG's. For so and so. Well done. But for someone so large, he fucking flies. You wanna you wanna know the secret to mystery game tournaments though, honestly, in games you don't really know how to play? Pick just the pick longest the, range just pick, who, just pick the guy who looks like he's the chunkiest, you know, the chonkiest guy, you know, the thickest. Are you supporting you know Thickies? Hell yeah, dude, I'm a uh, thickie. I love other my fellow thickies. I would not have said that, I would have just said big bodies. Hey, dude. Close enough, dude. Big bodies, thickies, whatever. Okay, so uh, I guess it's me versus Ikigai Anon. Well, made the game we picked for whoever wants the game, I guess. Uh, okay, this is gonna be FT3. So let's see I think... what kind of shenanigans we're gonna see now. It's gonna be Street Fighter the movie, and then I'm gonna sit here stoically looking at the screen that I sad that I can't play uh, Street no. Fighter the movie. Oh wait, join Meg fight? <laughs> God damn it! All right, fuck. Close enough. Damn, sad face. Oh, you really like? This is a game I have no fucking ish, no experience with. I've played it, but just pick the. There's five pages of characters. Pick the character on the fifth page at the farthest to the right. That's like the ultimate super good top tier. Ho oh. I'll just pick whatever. Like the Pokemon. Right. <laughs> oh, I Me have trying to, to coach. I have to get Joy Mech Fight, and that has a certain game to it. Oh no. Oh no. This is Teram. Joy Mac. Oh dear. Fight. And yes. F23. Okay. What? Is something wrong, Coach Jim? Uh, mm, I just looked at the game and I'm just like, no, 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 <laughs> not even anything. Where I just looked at the game and I, and I already see like shit going wrong. What joy mech fight? Kinda, yeah. Uh, joy mech fight has two issues that kind of hinder. It's play to some extent. And I take it for, you know, what it is that it's, um, 
It's an NES game. They can't properly code cross-ups, really. They couldn't really properly code throw loops or, like, throw protections, rather. So you just have some straight-up throw loops, and you have just some straight-up cross-up unblockables. And I used to think that that shit was, like, kind of annoying, but over time you realize there's no combos anyway, so those things kind of save the game in some regard. Because without those cross-up unblockables and throw loops, there's functionally no combos. So, like, mm, it is what it is. I, I enjoy the game. It is it is probably Kusoge, though. It is probably fucking... It is probably? Probably more on that end. You know, I, I mean, it's definitely... Yeah, I don't on, like that it's, word. Hmm. it's definitely on the it's definitely on the fucking edge like i don't know like i i'm super conservative on what i consider a fucking kusoge though so like a lot of games that you might consider kusoge i probably don't like i consider kusoge games that are just like poor in quality and that's pretty much it That's just me personally. I mean, I like everybody has their own definition at this point. There's like my, a thousand. My definition ones. is a is a poorly, poor, like, poor quality game, or a game with decent quality, but the balance is essentially when everyone is top tier, no one will be. I mean, yeah, I guess that's. I've heard some people like do that. Everything is broken. Shit too. Like as far I mean, as the definition, if it's not broken, pretty much any, pretty much like, anything can fit. If it's not broken, will it be really fun? That's basically what you gotta ask yourself. Yeah, because it's an NES game, this takes a bit to uh, find stuff. So I DM'd because the JSON link does not work with the NES games. Unfortunately. So. There's that. Hold on, I can try and... No, 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 I, uh, I got him the entire ROM set that I uploaded to the... Oh, yeah, you're right, you're right. Discord, so it's not a problem. I just told him where to put it. Because you have to put it in FBNeo ROM's NES folder, basically. Yeah. It's what it is. It, it is what it is. Oh shit. Ah uh, no. Scratch it. Scratch that. What happened? It's something that I did with Tomas a back ago, a, a while ago, and uh, the joy mech by the scene is TMNT. I'm almost tempted to go back to the car enough lobby and see what happens. All right. Oh, yeah, I know what you're talking about. We tried to play Beyond. Yeah. And it, like, halfway worked. Yeah. Which obviously isn't good enough to run a tournament for it. Can't work halfway half the time. All right. Um... Okay. X-Men Children of the Atom. Well, eight of them. <laughs> rest, rest in peace, Tarao. Yes. You're, you've been offered up to the Iki guy like uh, firing squad. Yeah, pretty much. I would have, I would have fully got like, I would have had my like entrails ripped out in this game too by Iki guy. So it's like, Iki guy's yeah. probably one of the better players in the states of this game. Like to be honest. Where is he? Oh, no, uh, don't tell me he's an ass rank. He, I don't know about, like, his fucking rank. I don't think any of that shit matters, but I know he does good in fucking tournaments. Yeah. In fighting game tournaments, he does well. Also... Yeah, and in Children of the Atom specifically, too. And, and some puzzle game... and some puzzle tournaments, he does pretty well. Also, yeah, I, I know nothing of puzzle games, because, like, when those... when those come up, I just... I black them out, because I don't... I can't fucking play puzzle games or the shit anyway. Right, I'm gonna get XM Coda. All right. Getting the bomb right now. That's basically how it goes. I mean, it doesn't matter. Like, I'm okay at them. I'm just not good at them. You know? 
Cause I think I'm not even o I'm not even okay, Tarao. Like I remember I, I was mean, playing Pokemon Puzzle League with my little like like four year old nephew and I was losing at Puzzle League, right? I'm just like inept. If anything, just being okay at uh, puzzle games is good enough in some cases. Just like Yeah. If you just wanna have fun, just getting okay at the game is enough. Because yeah. If anything, when I did that with Puyo Puyo Tetris, I specifically did Tetris, and I know at one point I had a case where I pissed off everyone because I kept winning, and every and then everyone turned on me, and I still won. It doesn't matter. Uh, occasionally. It's okay, um, but here's the thing, this is not the first time I've played in a mystery tournament XM code, you know, XM children are the Edo. Edo? Yeah, 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 Edo. <laughs> yeah, I say, I say stuff a little bit weird, so, yeah. Mm. Oh well, it is what it is, there's nothing we can do about this. Dio is a dumbass. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna. Uh, to... Where? Yeah, I'm just setting my controls, don't worry about it. <sighs> Mystery Tournament is gonna be bad. It's gonna be interesting with PS1 and Flaycast. <laughs> Which I might be able, which I might be doing a Flaycast tournament. Might. Soon. Uh, update on what's occurring, Toro. Oh. Ikigai is a bit, I say it, he's a bit uh, concerned. What do you mean? Concerned for what? Oh, there we go. Uh, we're just asking since you're silent and not, and even uh, Ikigo was like, what's happening? Yeah, that's okay. I'm just setting controls. Alright. Do your best. That's all you can do, Toro. By the way, did you know that Marvel was not happy when this game was made? Why? Uh, Capcom did, if I recall correctly, Capcom did this game behind their back. Behind Marvel's back, kinda. Oh, makes sense. And when Marvel found out what happened, they were not happy. But then they saw the success of the game and were like, Oh, okay, let's keep going then. Uh, then I might have been I might have been misinformed then if that's not the correct story. Uh... Oh no, it's, uh, no 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 no! I confused the story. Sorry, sorry, it wasn't this one. It was uh, it was I think it was Punisher actually. Was it? I, I believe it was. There is one game that there is initial like dislike and then the opinion shifted. I just couldn't remember which one it was, and I thought it was uh, this game. I thought it was this game. Oh, I... what, Coda? I mean... No, no, it was like a case of uh, one, a game was made behind my uh, with little knowledge from Marvel. Uh, oh, yeah, I have uh, no idea. Okay, then I'm just stupid. Ignore I thought you were, just, thought you were just saying public opinion or whatever. I was gonna say on release, this game wasn't particularly like specifically like a something between Marvel and Capcom, but 
You, you know what? I, I'm occasionally wrong, and this time I'm extremely wrong to the point where I'd you know, rather so, be you know, you know, I, I don't know anything about Coda, but you know, in, in Marvel vs. Capcom 2, Silver Samurai is like, you know, mid. he's like high mid-tier because, you know, his fucking super catches assists really well. I can offer no commentary for Coda, though. <laughs> Just give me survival arts. That's all I want. No. I saw Joy Mech fight come up. I know it's possible. I just want. Just give me Street Fighter the movie. Give me Jackie Chan. Give me some. <laughs> give, okay. give me World Warrior. <laughs> Tornado Crawl. Tornado Crawl. Yeah, the... We'll see, I guess. I am yeah, true. I am praying for super sidekicks, though. Oh, for the soccer game? Yeah, because you'll fuck me up in it. We played Super Sidekicks before, and I'm freer than, freer than shit in that game. Yeah, well, that's uh, that's the game I have um, uh, that I can do good in, or at least. Also, I want to know. Try the tournament, maybe. Also, I want to note Silver Samurai. Actually, I do have code information. Silver Samurai sucks in this game, but even Silver Samurai sucking in this game, he literally does like. Air normal into like grounded normal for like fucking thirty five percent. Isn't that a, a isn't that a thing for this game? All right, uh, Marvel also got mad at Kingpin. Up again. Marvel Wait, also got mad about Kingpin sprite in the Punisher arcade game, complaining he was too big and unrealistic, which led to a funny anecdote where the guy Ye who designed that Ye Kingpin saw into the Spider Verse and got Kingpin? upset. Kingpin. Kingpin in the Punisher game, though? Perfectly alright yeah. model. He's, I, he's thicker I, than fuck, dude. Are you ready, Thomas? Yeah, bro. Whatever. Actually, I have an advertisement up, like, for your stream right now, but it's about to... <laughs> that's, that's hilarious, actually. Actually, is it even gonna cold. end? Oh, never mind. Okay, yeah, it is. Alright. I'm watching the spin now. Oh, Breaker's Revenge? Alright. I'm not... I'm not good at Breaker's Revenge. This is a game I don't play, but hey, fuck it. Uh, I mean, I, like, that's worry. basically everything in bracket today. It's just like, S it. from what I remember, it's just like SD, is what people say, at least. This is the... Breaker's the sort of Revenge. Revenge. Right, Woo! We about to play some Breaker's Revenge, boy. But, but here, here's what you gotta do, right? Everything here's what you gotta do. Nah, dude, you just say, Woo! If you don't know how to play a game coast you just say, Woo! And you just, that carries you through, and you just start fucking... Yeah. I, I was gonna say, if you if you wanna get an edge on this game, just pick size, though. <laughs> nah, I'm not gonna do any of that. I'm just gonna say, Woo! I'm gonna see a... I'm gonna do all the shit I usually do. I'm gonna pick a big character, I'm gonna say, Woo! And then I'm gonna win, dude. It's, it's all you need. Yeah. He is right. <laughs> he is right. Uh, I have a bit of, like, I mean, I have a bit of experience, but that's like saying, I've uh, eaten some, uh, strawberry jam, but I'm, not. <laughs> I'm ready to go whenever. Okay, I'm gonna, I forgot to play do. Condor. Oh, okay. That's the Fuck grappler. It. Don't, don't yeah, fall Yo, he, is he, is he big? Hey, dude. Yeah. Yeah, he's big. If I, if I don't have me, at least Flynn has me. He's already, he's giving me the actual, like top tier coaching information that I need to know who's who's thick all right tell who's me a big when, boy tell me when you're ready because who's a biggie says, thicky because it says can challenge comes for tutorial at this moment oh well fuck I'm online okay oh well now I see you okay FD3 all right I'm br I'm I'm a devin myself too I way people don't have to hear my button matches don't deafen yourself to all the stream will not be able to hear you uh, to hear us. No, I won't. Or rather won't be able to hear me. Just me. This game I actually know some sh 
some stuff, more of basics, but this is this is in in a way a very fun game to play. But it was also the the type of game you play with friends, and you'd all just end up becoming like you just get your combos down and everything in like five minutes. Cho, Saizo are the top tiers. A a honorable mention would go to uh, there's one character whose name I forgot, uh, but but basically that character is just like rush down machine, button in the button. Uh, yeah, Tia, Tia, Tia is a honorable mention in a way. Uh, Kiara has the the really funny back dash and forward dash sound. Yeah, that's the only. That, that's the. That's each. Mm. Uh, Condor is the grappler that keeps kicking my ass every time I play. Show is supposedly the show, but in reality, he's just a war crime. <laughs> it's just a war crime against the fighting game balance. Uh. Yeah, there's also Rila, just another another highlight of fun characters to play. Anyway, going down the list, uh, Rila is like a very wild character. I actually, like, despite hating playing against her, I actually like seeing her in action in a way. Uh, there, there's also there's also like Saizo, who has the who has the I win anti air button. Also known as DP. <laughs> just like, you wanna tell people that you're good at anti airing? Just just pick Slice They can't say they can't say you're not. He, he gets to exist, yeah, he, he 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 gets to throw projectiles through yours on okay. He, he gets to throw projectiles through yours, he gets to anti air you the moment you decide to jump. Uh, that's the other one. Uh, he has a super. He has the frog and spike ball super. Again. That I th that's something I didn't know. I didn't know that you can. It's just. Wait, actually. I would like to know why would you say that, uh, Scotty? Is it his like double per circle back kick super? Or the flaming dive kick, I guess. Oh my god. Yeah, uh, that, that's that's very weird. I, I never ever caught anyone anti oh It was an attempt. But it was too too messy. Just play the neutral. The perfect's gone. Thomas, it's oh, the one possible break of new, the one breakout, the fireball. Ah, good job, Taro. You got your, you got your win. Yeah. Yeah, don't don't worry about the don't worry about the dive kick. It's perfectly balanced. The the, the only rival, the only dive kick that rival say is uh, rise dive kicking Maki Maku.
the spot, the only dive kick that rivals it, and even then, that 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 other dive kick that I'm talking about isn't even a dive kick. It's just a drop kick. I'm looking at the wrong thing again. But now we're down to one of the. Actually, there's one other. Well, the sweep. Just to. Ooh. By the way. Did you know that if you did an overhead attack, you can actually combo into a super with Cho? Yeah, me neither. I genuinely thought it was a myth, and then when I found out that it was actually a thing, I was like... I could have been doing this a long time ago. Like, you could do three light kicks into the overhead, or no, sorry, three light kicks into standing heavy punch, and then the overhead, which is A plus B, I believe, and then just buffer in a super. If it hits, go for it. If it doesn't, just, just sit there. <clears throat> Back that shit. <laughs> Dude, this is Loser's final. I don't judge anyone who for backdashing on round start. By the way, here's here's BL, the the funniest backdash anime, the, the funniest backdash sound in any fighting game. Whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> Kill in general is just a bunch of uh. PL's, PL, PL is basically like, oh my god. Are we playing, are we playing Breaker's Revenge or Sailor Moon S? Uh, that's... Uh, PL, PL nonsense, nonsense everywhere. Right now, show or Torao sitting on three bars to Tom Tomas's uh, num singular right. Never mind, and the bar is gone. Ooh, into your rep punches. So having a hard time. Ooh. Oh. And uh, Mr. Terrell actually moves on. Well done. Yeah, I, pr I maybe should have stuck to Condor, but honestly, it's a fucking mystery tournament. It doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah. By the way, did you know that you could cut uh, A plus B is an overhead? Or uh, both punches together is an overhead? And I have no Jake. clue how to play fucking breakers. That's pretty much it. This is you. This is one of the few games I actually did enough time to actually learn a thing or two. Oh man! And <laughs> and the last thing I learned before I dropped the game for a while was uh, how you could cut. You can use a uh, shows uh, command overhead or or just overhead, I guess. And if you buffer in a super behind it, you can actually combo into it. Uh. So you can catch someone ducking and well, kill him for it. Well, let's see if I'm ready for this, because I'm not sure I am. Okay. Yeah, before it gets to... I'm gonna roll out now. It's been a, it's been a fun time though, Taro. These yeah. roasts and survival arts and all that shit. Yeah, sure. We were playing survival arts. Yep, yep. Ago, man. GGs, y'all. Peace. Good, good games. See ya. All right, let's see what we got. The oh. so, final roll of the tournament. <laughs> I'm sorry, re-roll. No, no, I'm not re-rolling. <laughs> re-roll. No, I'm sorry, no. no. Re-roll, I don't like it here. I hate it here. <laughs> <laughs> no. No. <laughs> no, uh, you know what, uh, why this spin is I'm ironic? leaving. I'm leaving. <laughs> you know why this spin is ironic? <laughs> is that Ikigai's main game is S.
S V C K R Super Force. Okay, re roll. No. <laughs> no. It is what it is. <laughs> uh no, this is gonna be a mess. Why do we <laughs> when even the ending is just random, just I hate it. Here's the thing. I feel accomplished by the fact that I won against Tamas, so You're you're down you're in second place. This is the second place you would have gotten in in Ragnar Hard. Ragnar Hard. Yeah. Technically. Yeah. So I really I re I am I don't I, I I have nothing against this. It's just this spin is really really ironic. <laughs> Look at, look I would have found it more. I would have found it more ironic if we ended on Ragnarok, Ragnagard. Yeah. There we go. I pronounced it right. Finally, Ragnagard. Oh. If we ended on that one, it'd be like we're back to sofa. Well, we don't need. To we're back because... to the sofa bracket. Well, we don't need to because Ragnagard is coming as a tournament this week. So. Uh. <laughs> yeah, time to get steamrolled into nothingness. Here's Shot. The, here's the thing. No quit, the ne quit the negativity. You talked. We talked about this. Quit the negativity. Come on. <laughs> is uh is Iki guy gonna do random selects? No, no. Dude, Why am I getting banged? Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, uh, someone just. Someone sent me a challenge immediately after I joined. Uh, I guess I'm watching the stream for now. Which. He. he this is a crime. Why is he playing Street Fighter in an SNK game? Jesus! Wait, I, oh no, I got to the wrong- I- mm, I joined the wrong lobby. No, no, there we go, no more- No more stream. No, I can't watch it myself. Yes, Kill me. Okay. I won't. Hold on. This is anyone's game. Did he just do hard punch into sweep? He, <laughs> he tried for some hurricane and dropped it. That's, ah, oh, that's unfortunate. Nah, kind of. Enjoying the match, to be honest. You just keep hitting him with the big, with the big swing attacks. Just you hit him with the uh, hit him with the uh, with the uh, with the uh, I can't remember the name of the swing. It, I know I know what it's called in Spanish. I don't know what it's called in English. Hit him with the Baracampos. Do it. Just why hit every time? Wind your. The thing is, I have an issue with inputs. I mean, I haven't practiced enough to go. Fair enough. Also, I find this weird. How is the bootleg version of the game much more popular than the base game? 
Yeah, you mean the super Yeah, the, I, I joined the lobby on accident. I saw there were more people there, and when I went to join the correct lobby, there was less. Oh. Version of it. Oh shit! This has card cancels. Guile pressure has never been seen in a Street Fighter game. Oh, yeah, even the bonus guy. Uh, that that makes more sense then. Uh, also, uh, God pressure has never been seen before. Crashing medium kick into hard punch into medium kick into hard punch. Oh. Yeah, the Bobiga chains are really pretty. Like, I love record characters. It's what I prefer to play in playing games. Bodega, Bodega. Bodega, Bodega, Denezi. I, I remember there's a joke I made before where someone was learning KOF. Uh, I think it was like. It was one of the later KOF games, not 13 or 14. I mean, something in between. I remember I made a joke about uh, about uh, it about his special, the the fucking bodega. I just can't remember what it was. Uh, what the? I'm just, I'm just, I'm just baffled at the things that I'm seeing. This is what I was been missing out with this game. Damn. I, 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 we're back to Street Fighter 2 with these Sonic booms. You're not getting out of My god, Stinky guys, stop. Stop bullying him. He just wants to play the game. He was having fun before. Oh, there we go. No, I have fun in there. It's fun to get out of that. Yeah. If you're not a good player, you won't get out of that. So you're telling? Oh. At, at least there. At, at least there's confidence there. No, there's always. If you're a bad player, you don't get out of. If you. If you're a bad player, you don't get out. Therefore, you got out, which means you are a good player. Or maybe Ikigai was taking it easy on me. In whichever case. Um, he, can't, he, he can't hear what I'm saying. He's probably in the stream. <laughs> and the stream has audio. So I mean, nine people for a mystery tournament for me. That's good. Yeah. So, let's see. Mm, okay, so... Congratulations to Ikigai Anon, you're the champion of the, I think it's uh, eight uh, mystery tournament. Yeah, eight. Probably. Seventh, uh, according to, according to the title of the challenge, no, 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 it's no. the seventh. Wait a minute, it's the seventh? Yeah, okay, it's, it's You put seventh. Yeah, okay, so it's seventh. So, yeah. Here Ikigai, comes the challenger! Ikigai is the champion of the 7th uh, Mystery Tournament. Hope everyone had fun. Sorry that Majin couldn't make it, but you know, we do Mystery Tournaments once a month. Uh, the games that show up on here are going to be... Not going to be, but are suggested by the Tendere community. So anyone that wants to suggest stuff like... Actually, uh, Torah, I believe uh, I believe I am wrong. This is actually the eighth. There's just you have you have two mystery tournaments that go with no number, like yeah, probably you have two oh, that sorry. are basically outright just mystery tournaments. So that's I'll what made it. me believe that. Yeah, I'll one, two, I'll check when I do three, like a four. backup video because I do backup videos on YouTube after this. But oh, yeah. never mind, never mind, never mind. Forget, forget I said anything. 
That's I'm stupid. Uh, so yeah, we do it. We we do this once a month. So games that show up here on the list are suggested by the uh, Tenderia Discord community. Um. So anyone that wants to join or and request games is welcome to do so. But yeah, these are not just fine games, as you said, as you saw. We have puzzle games, sports games. Unfortunately, Fight Key doesn't have racing games yet, but it might do with the inclusion of like a GGPO, which I don't know when it's gonna be. With that said, hope everyone had fun, and I'll see you at the next gathering, which should be, I think, Friday. Yeah. So, see ya, chat. I'm ending the stream.